Good morning, everyone. That's right. The events of September 11th have changed the lives of so many people around the world. And in the years since that day, thoughtful events and efforts have been providing a means for grieving, for healing, for loving, and of course, for learning. Now, joining me this morning, we have two very special guests who are here to talk about this special 5K run in honor of a fallen firefighter from the New York Fire Department. His name, again, was uh, Stephen Sills, and he ran three miles from the Brooklyn Battery Tunnels all the way to the towers with 60 pounds of gear. And this morning we have a 5K run in honor of Stephen. First annual here in Hawaii. And we have here Chief Glenn Kaovai. He is the Deputy Chief of Operations with the Federal Fire Department. Good morning, Chief. Good morning. How are you? Good. How are you? How, what does this mean for everyone at the fire department here locally? Well, locally, uh, we've been tasked with a lot of uh, requests, and uh, unfortunately, we had to turn some down. But this is one of the most important ones that we feel that uh, the bigger impact with the military component, as well as our brother city firefighters as well, um, just to support the uh, events that did occur during that time. Um, we just want to remember, and for our younger firefighters as well, to just to uh, keep that thought in their back of their mind when this time comes during the year. Yeah, this must be a very emotional time. Again, I wanted to correct myself. It's Stephen Siller, the Stephen yeah. Siller 5K run. Um, in addition to that, you know, we've had some amazing, incredible stories. And here right now we have Kathleen Yee. He's, she's the TSA inspector. And we have a special little guy here. His name is Lake with two L's. And Kathleen, tell us a little bit about his story. Thank you, Yasmin. Uh, Lake is named after William David Lake, who was a New York City firefighter that died on 9-11. Lake was with Rescue 2 out of Brooklyn. Um, he's a TSA puppy program dog, and they name all their dogs after 9-11 victims or fallen soldiers. The last name of the victim becomes the first name of the dog. Thus, his name is Lake with a double L. Lake was um, born on 9-11, 2006, so a very fitting tribute to his namesake. So we want to wish Lake a very happy fifth birthday. Oh, wow. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> well, of course, in dog years, he's 35 years old. But um, we also wanted to mention the family still remembers Lake. Although they raised him the first year, they sent a very special happy birthday this morning, didn't they? They did, yes, mean. Um, the Castillo family out of Austin, Texas, raised Lake for the first year of his life. They had three children. They did a wonderful job of raising Lake. And they sent him a birthday message this morning. So... They will never forget either. Oh, well, thank you so much, Kathleen. Thank you so much, Chief. And happy birthday, Lake. Paul, Jody, we are really excited to show you all the runners that are here. And we have a couple of other special uh, treats coming up later in the broadcast. Back to you in the studio.